Hey, what's up everyone? My name is Cap and welcome back to the channel. We're on day 43 of our Darkness Falls series. I hear somebody stomping around. I want to make sure there's not a horde out here before we start doing anything crazy. We've had a few random hordes just show up lately and just waltz into existence. Seem to be like right next to me and I really don't want that to happen while I'm trying to do something. Alright, I see Brittany ambling along over here and Owen's way over there. That's fine, that's fine. No big deal. As long as y'all kind of leave leave me alone just a little bit, that'd just be gravy. Okay, so a couple things I did last night just to kind of keep you guys abreast of the situation. Uh, was it, eh, it wasn't over here. It was over, well, I used the writing desk. Okay, so I went through and I made some more generic schematics because they're not that hard to make. Uh, you can see right over here. You need paper, ink, quill, and blueberries. So, first things first before we can get here, I need to get some blueberries planted. Now, I could get rid of some of the stuff that I have here and just, you know, keep going this direction. But I think what I'm going to do is keep building out this direction and uh, get a secondary portion of the farm going here. I've got, how many do I have? I have enough for five, so it's nothing, you know, dramatic basically about how many I have to have. I think I'm just going to start it right about here. Just to get a couple more going down, uh, that should be deep enough. I'm going to keep it going with the diamond pattern that I've been doing over there just because even though it keeps getting rid of a block on both sides. Brittany, what's you doing? You'll come over here and help me with some hoeing? <laughs> it's terrible, Cap. You need to quit it. That right there is one of those things I was talking about recently, whatever, when you're trying to do the diggy stuff and it's being a pain in the butt. Hang on, she's definitely getting close. What's up, girl? Knock, knock. Make sure you didn't bring any of your stupid friends over here with you. Yeah, okay. So, anyway, I need to go down two, basically, and then uh, I can put a block like right there. That should be... Am I down two already? I am down two. Okay, so I can do like one, two... Okay, that should technically work. Now I just need to make a rain barrel, put it down in there. We can slap some seeds in there and we'll call it good. No, this isn't the only way that can uh, this can be done, but it's the way I'm doing it here. Okay, so I now I uh, don't need sticks. I need wood and I think I need nails. I can't remember what else do you need for a rain catcher. Iron, not nails. Okay, so this is kind of in the same ballpark, just the wrong, wrong one here. Rain catcher, boom, get rid of you. I was like, where did this stuff come from? I was like, oh yeah, that's the stuff I'm planning on uh, selling when I do go back over to the trader here to turn in this one little quest. That's what it's for. All right, so I'm going to put you down right over here in the right spot. Put you down like right. Am I doing it all the way down for those? I am doing it all the way down. Okay. Down there at the bottom. You should be good. We'll get some water in you here in just a short amount of time. Get okay, one, two, three four and five okay so you fill up here in the very near future and we'll be good to go on getting some more blueberries because we need those in order to be able to make generic schematics now the reason why i did that is because i put my one skill point into the science crafting here so like i can make myself the radiation ready mods of course the um rad remover mod all the tier three mods i can actually now make but it takes a generic schematics like a bunch of these it takes 15 to make one i have one rad remover mod on my m4 i would like to have one on my shotgun on my pistol you know just because it's probably a really good idea honestly so that's kind of where i'm going with that uh let's see i started cooking down oh okay i guess it's cooking down i got a hundred of both of those and some cement going i got some more cement making over here so basic level stuff i did overnight i think we're good to go i do have you know what hang on we, we got to do it how are you on durability you're not you don't have much on you at all hold on i need to get some gas Durability wise, it's definitely taken a beating, but I definitely need to make some gas with this here too. I don't even know how much you hold, but we're okay on fuel for a little bit. And if for some reason I do need to actually get over to the, uh, to the, uh, shale area, the desert, it's not too far to get over there, especially on this little bike. How's your durability? I should probably repair you. I should probably repair you. I totally can see me smacking into a tree. And kind of doing my thing the wrong way again today. I'm having a problem with words. Have y'all noticed that today? I don't know what my deal is. Okay, good to go. Okay, now good to go. All right, we'll go. Holy cow. Calm down. I'm not even turboing it up here. Okay, we're going to get going in a nice straight line. We'll be good to go. This one just goes so much faster than literally every other vehicle in this game, I think. All right, can we clear the hill? Wee! 
Anybody ever see that movie from the, I think it was from the 80s, maybe the early 90s, the dirt bike kid? Dude could freaking fly on a dirt bike. It was pretty sweet. All right, brakes, brakes. Last time we came over, we figured out how the wall works at high speeds, and it doesn't really. Oh, also, that's the other thing I did, too, was I went ahead and uh, accepted another treasure chest, and it happens to be, like, right here. It's, like, right there. So it's kind of up in the general area where we've already been before. That one looks like it's kind of on the middle of the road, which I hope is not the case because I have to dig under. Hey, okay. Something good for me, please? Apple pie. That's what I got last time. What is up with you and apple pies? I mean, they're good. It gives me a wellness boost. Sure, I'll take it. Sure, sure, sure. Why not? Okay, buy a couple things from me, though, okay? Hey, we're up to 13,000 monies. We're slowly getting there. We're slowly getting there. Ah, thank you. Ah, thank me, too. Hey, look at that. I went out the correct door this time. So, initially, what I was thinking about doing was uh, not necessarily this episode, but sometime in the very near future, I was considering going over and doing the rocket launch thing. After doing just a teeny little bit of research on that, I think that might be a horrible idea until I have a stupid amount of ammo, because apparently that place is a horde night in itself. It is just absolutely chocked full of zombies in quantities that shouldn't be allowed inside one POI. I don't want to go over and spend an entire day trying not to die just yet. Now, from what I could read about, that there's a stupid amount of loot in there, and that could be lots of fun. But I uh, also don't want to waste all the ammo I do have just yet, so we're going to get to it, just not quite yet. Please be not on the road. You're, ugh, you're on the road. Of course you're on the road. Why wouldn't you be? Hey, what's up, dude? Headshot. I'm going to search your truck, see if you got anything good in here for me. Maybe a little extra gas or a potato seed. Why do you have two trucks here, sir? I'm going to guess you stole one. Hey, a little bit of gas and some nails. That whole 13 units of gas ought to go ahead and top off the tank, right? Right? Woohoo! That was, that was pretty fantastic. Okay, so we're going to do what we did last time. I'm going to drop a few frames down right on the edge so we can kind of see which direction this scooches in once we get a little bit... Okay, seriously. Would you just... There you go. So we can see which direction it scooches in. We'll just keep that one in line with the truck. Now, since this one is on the road, I'm either going to have to pickaxe my way in or dig in from the side. Hang on. We got jiggles over here. Come here. Knocked you flat on your butt. Tell you what. Let's do this. You're not a very good boxer. <laughs> anyway, so here's what the the plan is for the day. is I'm going to find this treasure, this little hidden treasure that's over here, because we could always use the extra cash, we could use the extra ammo. And then I want to go back over and I want to get back into the um, the uh, the original crack of book that we want to. I want to run through and grab everything that's in there pretty much and then scrap all of it down. Because you got to have 600 skill notes in order to be able to make a mastery book. And I have like 400 and something, 400 and change. I don't remember how many I have total, but it's not 600 yet. And since the other cracker book we just did, you know, not long ago, it's definitely not going to be going up anytime soon to where we can do it again. I mean, and uh, I just need, I need to get as many skill notes as possible. Okay. Which direction are you scooching in? All right. So you moved away from that block a little bit, kind of move away from that one. That one's still touching and that one... Kind of hard to tell. All right, let's get it to scooch in one more set of uh, one more block here, and then we can figure out which direction it's going. All right, so it's moving away from me over here. It moved away from the truck. It's still kind of close to that one. It's kind of moving. So it's kind of moving that direction ish. Ish. That's a big word, is ish. All right, so we got Lois. We got a chicken. I don't think the chicken's part of any kind of horde, but I could be wrong. I got to keep an eye out for things. These treasure chests, and oh, there's a wolf. These treasure quests. Tre treasure quests <laughs> treasure quests don't spawn uh, i'm not doing that uh, while it'd be nice to have all the rocks i'm not going to do that they don't spawn in spawn in hordes specifically but that doesn't mean that the random hordes aren't going to show up we had that happen in the last one and it's definitely not something i want to have to deal with is these idiots come running at me while i'm you know knee deep inside a hole so we're going to dig ourselves a little tunnel into the middle so if we can't get this to collapse the circle a little bit. Somebody had did say that wearing the looting glasses 
which I don't have, would make, it doesn't help with uh, looting much anymore, but it helps with the dig circle. I don't have any. I don't think I've ever even seen any yet in this playthrough. I could have, and just don't remember. What's up, Lois? What doing? Yeah, to you too. Bonk. Dude, blew her mind, and now her mind is currently rolling down the hill. Hey, Frank, if you're looking for a girl, there's... Well, part of one's coming your direction. Just keep a heads up. And I should probably... Probably... Just because he'll end up in the hole with me, too. And some free meats. Give me all meat. It's only eight. But since I just used all the meat that I did have pretty much to make some steak and taters, probably not a bad idea. All right, Tim, you can come over here and help me dig a hole if you want to. I just have to assume if everybody in this game, you would be the most equipped to help me dig a hole. There it is. That didn't take too bad. That, that wasn't too bad. Let's see if it lines it up perfectly. The first. Almost. Look at that. Almost perfectly lined up at the very beginning. 3,800 monies and a bunch of ammo and parts again and a crappy stun baton. But we got some gunpowder, so that's something I don't have to make. Fantastic. Thank you, game. That didn't even take that long. Make sure we don't have a random horde. The wolf's looking for its buddy. I apologize, but um, your buddy's no longer here. Um, he was getting a little bit too close, and he and I had to part ways just a little bit. I'm sorry about that. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to head back. Whoa, calm down. I'm going to head back towards town and see if I can't remember. Uh... <laughs> See if I can't remember where that crack a book is. The, it's been a little bit since we went over there. I think it's generally, I have an idea of where it's at. This is really not the bike to be tooling around town. I still don't know what this building was. Initially, I thought this building was the museum that we went to in the Wasteland Warrior series. Because it kind of has a similar vibe to it. But this whole glowing red thing thing that's doing, I don't think, uh, I'm almost certain it is since it says Cure Co. I can't imagine going into some place that's literally radiating bright red would be very, very good for your health. Just, you know, call me crazy. There's the rocket in the distance. So I believe the crack of book is somewhere generally kind of sort of close over here. Here it is. That didn't take us too long. This pl Last time we were here, a horde showed up. So I'm just going to imagine it's going to show up again. All right, you too, lady. Oh, hey, hey, brought me some loot. What'd you bring? A pump shot and some shotgun ammo. You know what? That's okay. That's okay. I appreciate it. I can always use that to repair mine. Are you good? No, you're not good. That one's not good either. All right, so last time we was... It's been a little bit since we've been here. Oh, so there's a mini. There's a glowy. Okay. Well, let's see. We can get some snappy snipes with this. to so get a little bit of sneak damage. Not a lot, but just maybe just a little bit. Or we can scare the bathroom wall over there. There we go. Okay, now you can come outside. Don't bring any of your friends with you. Just you. Nice for you to bring me some loot. See, we do it all nice and quiet like, and then we don't wake everybody up while we're dealing with the meanie here. Some map, uh, a map and some cash. Money! Hate to deprive people of the weird random sayings that I say that some people actually like. Somebody said when I said hello one day without actually had, having the uh, the way I normally say it, it threw them off. They were kind of weird. Oh, hey! Freaking Kyle? <laughs> kind of startled me, I'm not going to lie. Come out this way just a smidge, right? Right there. Now, right there we go. Popped his top. All right, now we can get a couple more going here. He's a big meanie. She's a big meanie. There's just a... Uh-huh, uh -huh. uh -huh. you missed that time, didn't you? Stay down, lady. She's a tough nut to crack. Okay, well, if they all respond in there, maybe the books did too. Money and some vitamins. I haven't actually taken any vitamins today. Get my wellness up. That should take it up to 253. 254. Let me re let me phrase that. I thought it went up by two. Hazmat gloves. Nice. I need those to be I need to be able to scrap those down for the has and stuff. I did scrap all the has equipment that I did have at the house for the hazmat fibers that I can use to make Z mods with. I just haven't done it yet. Now that I actually have them unlocked. 
Okay, let's do a quick lap around the bottom. See if there's anybody down here we haven't woken up yet. In the banyos. Yep, there's there's a couple. Did we not take something from in here? Oh, I didn't even search that one. Oh, that one wasn't nearly as good. He's like, what's going on? Seagulls! Oh, okay, here comes some meanies. You're a mean one. And you brought me a trick-or-treating bag. Blue key card, steel chest armor, steel scrap armor. Steel chest armor, that's, I don't think, what, what are we wearing currently? We have an iron chest armor. Steel is a little better when it comes to armor. But this being a low level seven here, I would end up losing. You see where I'm at here? See, I've got three mods on here and I need all of those. So that's a no-go. That, that helmet's not terrible compared to what I have. But this one's heavy versus this one's light. So it doesn't use as much stamina. Know what I mean? Hang on, where's my apple pies? I can go ahead and eat one of these. Since they, since I won these fair and square, I'm going to go ahead and eat me some pie. Hello? Okay. Run around this way, see if there's anybody else that's awake. We'll go upstairs in a minute, but I want to finish searching the... They said not even the bathrooms. I thought they were, but it's more just the storeroom. Okay, are we cool? No, we're not cool. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Oh, hey, I didn't even see you there. See, this is why I need more than one rad remover bot, so I don't have to keep using my... Um, M4 for the radiated zombies, which, hey, calm down, hang on, which they're seeing a lot more of. He brought me some trick-or-treating bags, too. Lucky loot! Oh, I was just talking about that. Loot bonus plus 20, dig reduction plus minus three. Oh, yes, game! Oh! Reload speed plus 10% is good, but, oh, that's fantastic! Oh, so when we're doing some treasure stuff and thingies now, we can get a smaller... Yeah! What are you? A black sky? Hang on. Hold up. What are you and what do you use here? Legendary Desert Vault. Oh my god. So the tail state is 50% more damage to all targets when night falls. Disables demonic regeneration. <gasps> Holy crap. This is our new Horde Knight gun. What, what do you take here? You take 44 ammo? <laughs> oh. This is the best freaking day. Let's go grab some books and then we'll do some scrapping. See if there's anything that we have to have and then we'll scrap all the ones that we don't. Okay, so that's... I, wait, did I get the box up top? I did. Okay, so I believe in a thing called love. Let me check you real quick just in case. Yeah, sure, I'll take some yeast. Why not? Somebody wrecked that one. Okay, so hang on real quick. I'm going to get over here near the door in case bad things go bad. I need to run real quick. Let's see. I got a bunch of books. See which ones I don't need. I don't care about the ding dong knocker. So let's scrap you. The yucca smoothie. Uh, I don't know about that one. Pistol note. So there's definitely like, okay, so the chainsaw. I'm definitely going to read that because that could be cool. Let me scrap all the ones that are definitely already open and red. So I don't have to worry about those. Steel armor schematic. That could be useful since I don't think I can actually use that. And then I can scrap that one. Automatic weapon here. I need to double check on that one, but I don't think I'm there yet. Automatic weapons is at 79, so I definitely need to read both of those. Now we're at 83. Yeah, yeah. Okay, safe cracking for dumb shits. I think I'm good on that one. Let's see. Where's our mining? Where's our mining skill at here? Mining tools is at 83. You know what? For these, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and scrap both of those because I could use the notes. That's the whole reason I came over here. And mine will go up just fine. Athletics, I know... I'm a thousand percent certain that I'm not there yet, but this one goes up just from running and jumping around, so I can get rid of that one as well. Uh, I'll use you because yucca smoothies are good. Pistol notes, I don't believe I'm at the, I believe I can't spell those. 65 on that one, so I'll definitely read both of those. I need to get them up as high as possible because then it does more damage. The It's just better to have it, you know what I mean? Shotgun notes, I doubt I'm at 100 on that one. No, 58 on that one, so let's bump this one up to 60. Teaches lock picking. I swear, it. why was that in two different sites? Okay, let's go ahead and scrap you down. Rifle notes, I don't believe I'm there on that one either. Nope, that one's only at 44. That one's much lower. Safe cracking, okay, so all the safe cracking ones are not stacking, but that's okay. I can scrap all of those to begin with here. 
how many notes is I gonna put in? 28? That's not a lot. There are a couple we read in there for sure, but dude, can you believe this gun? Holy crap. All right, I do know we have the entire upstairs too. There's the bathroom. That's a big Frank, right, y'all? Okay. Haha. <laughs> Ruined your potty break, didn't I? Uh oh. Well, that wasn't me. I didn't do it. Frank went all to pieces. Blew open the crapper and everything. Left some nasty meats in there, too. I'm not even going to check in there. If Big Frank was in here, I can't even imagine how terrible things are in there. All right, so let's see how many idiots we have in here. Nothing, nobody laying on top of the bookshelves. Let's tiptoe right over here. Who are you? That's a radiated big mamma jamma, right, y'all? So let's see if we can't get a little bit of a sneaky shot. Little 4.5 action right there. See, our life's still going up, but that's not a big deal. Where are you going? Uh-oh, she took one on the Achilles. I think she went down. Scooch over here a little bit. I'm trying to go a little bit quiet. She'll get a lot of her life back here. I'm trying to go a little quiet so I can get the jump on all the rest of the idiots before they wake up. Because, you know, it's just good practice. Careful, we hit a noise trap. Ammo, ammo, an auto shotty? Oh, dude. Auto shotty. Now it's a low level one compared to the one I already have, but still. Oh, I thought I could make that. An auto shotty? Man, I can't make those yet. I don't think I can make an auto shotty. Nope, I can't make one yet. Okay, so there's that. That's cool. Very, very cool. I hope there's a whole lot of books up here. Uh, it, it's one of those challenging moments thing where it's like, well, I kind of need all of these books to be scrapped down because I need the notes for them. But then on the other side, it's like, I kind of need to read it. What the hell? There we go. Oh, we missed. Come here, Sylvia. Oh. Jump around. Jump around. No. Shh. You're going to wake up whoever's laying over in the corner and they're they're green and glowing. Did you like it? I sure did. Okay, let's try it like this. If we need... Hang on, let's ease it up. Okay, now we can get right... What is going on with there? Is that... Uh, is that Eddie? Kind of looks like him. I don't think we're going to be able to get a headshot with him laying in the floor. We'll try, though. <laughs> no, not that one. Let's try one more over here. Got him. What's up, big man? No, Doc. Arlene. Oh, hang on. I got to reload. Oh, crap. Walked backwards into a rail like a moron. I'm trying to diversify and use different kinds of ammo. You know what I mean? Hang on. I got to reload again. Thank you, ma'am. What'd you bring me? Blue key cards, some scrap boots. Eh, that's all garbage. Let's try real hard not to miss with a shotgun and ac accidentally like blow off a uh, bookshelf over here because that's just about my luck too. All right, so let's see. What we'll do is we'll start here and then we'll make our way around to the front. Okay, I believe that's about it. Now let's see what we have. We'll go through and scrap what we don't need for sure just to kind of clear up some space. Banana pancakes. Um, Yes, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Scrap both of those because I know I don't need them. All right, that's going to leave me with these sets of books that I actually do want. We got automatic weapons, pistols, rifles, and shotgun notes. Same ones that I already have there. That got us with 70 there, so that's pretty good. That's not too bad. That's a pretty good haul, I do say so myself. That's a good freaking haul. I don't remember. No, there's nothing on top of this place. I have an idea, though. Here's what I'm going to do. Because I think this will be a good idea. If I hit the right button, it would be an even better idea. All right, so let's see. I'm going to do a save away point here with... Uh, is there, there's one right there. Is that what day it is? 43. Okay, so now when I look at the map, I can be like, hey, by the way, when when did I last come over here? Crack a book on day 43. So on day 50, I guess, which would be Horde Night Day. Horde Night Day? Yeah, Horde Day Night. Uh, we can come back over here and loot it again. Now, I kind of want to see... Uh, a, I need to drop off a bunch of stuff. And B, I kind of want to see how close I am to being able to make a mastery book. Um, I don't want to have to make a mastery book if I could just buy one, but uh, they're a tremendous amount of money, like a whole lot. 
I kind of think having those looting glasses we just put on, on top of having our looting skill go up, kind of helped out. We got an auto shot, even if it is a low level one. It still goes rat a tat tat real fast. And having the Black Death or whatever this gun is, is absolutely fantastic too. We're gonna, that's gonna be our Horde Knight gun over there, because we have a dumb amount of. Hang on, I gotta make sure this actually filled up like it's supposed to. Good. Okay, good. You're growing, you're growing, you're gonna do your thing. You're gonna do your thing. Sweet. Oh, man, we gotta... Okay, we can hide the... This is what we were using. Let's check out the stats on that one. 79.6 versus this one. But, but... 50% more damage to all targets when night falls. That's a tremendous amount of damage extra increase there. And disables demonic regeneration. Since we're going to be getting to those idiots in the very, very near future, that's probably something good to have. All right, let me drop off all this garbage real quick. Okay, so I want to make I want to make a rad remover remover of this mod right here for my shotgun. I've got 42 generics bundle skill notes. I do want to check to see because I'm pretty sure and we'll be able to make a what was that going security mastery book. Uh, bundle of skill notes. Oh, I have to have the look. I'm three away from being able to have enough for that, and then of course for the actual class book, which is under here need 120 so you gotta have 600 we're not really that close but i wanted to see we need 123 more i think is where i if my math correctly i don't know if i did or not all right where's glue and mechanical parts and some springs okay and then over here on the old workbench rad remover mod boom get you crafting i'm gonna put you on my shotgun because that would just be lovely for me Put all of this back over here. Make sure I didn't actually put anything useful in there. I have gold and silver nuggets that I found that I could sell technically, but I need those for like the broadcast mod, I think. This is what I need it for. Now, can I make a better pump shoddy than what I currently have? A 31 and I'm currently sitting at a 39, so I cannot yet. I need to be able to get my shotgun skill up one more to right here. Well, then it still won't go below 31, but at least I can repair mine without going down. I do not have a skill point yet. We're kind of getting there. But in order to be able to get down to make like a cool shotgun, we still got a little ways to go on that one. Low player level 60, and we are in 52, closing in on 53. Got a little ways to go on that one. I'm going to get... Hang on. Shh. Turn off your headlamp. Yep. There's a radiated freaking wandering whore. Look at that. I can see a couple blobbies. I see a demo zombie. Hang on. There's two demo zombies in there. Look at that. Big chungus. Some blobbies. Oh, a night stalker. Oh, we have reached the point in which really, really bad things show up in the hordes. Where's our game stage at? 188. Okay. Yeah, let's be very, very, very quiet. Shh. We don't need any of that coming over here. No. Absolutely not. Make sure everything is reloaded real quick. Actually, I'm going to have to redo that one here in a second anyway. Okay, got it. All right, so now on you, I should be able to slap you on here. That'll help out a little bit. So now I can use my shotgun against some of them big beefers along with my M4. Getting one on my pistol would also be good, but I'm not sure. Okay, I do have a spot over there for it. Okay, good. I wasn't 100% sure if I did or not, but yeah, I did. Okay, put you over there. Just in case, I like to keep everything topped off. Grab you and put you over there. So we're definitely not going the direction that... There's a cop over there too... I see old Blinky boys kind of just hanging out right over there. Um, yeah, let's, how about, well, very quietly, while we're waiting for the horde to disappear, because if you know anything about the hordes, they like to hang out. Indefinitely. They show up to your general area, and then they wander around, and they just kind of look to see where you are. Trying to keep our visibility down a little bit here so they don't see us. Yeah, they are definitely, definitely... Coming this direction. Time for us to be super de duper quiet. That's for sure. Okay. 
we're going to just go down in here very quiet like and we're going to hide behind this counter over here in the corner and we're not going to make any noise we're not going to open anything we're not going to touch anything we're just going to sit right here for a little bit and give them a chance to get bored <laughs> so what that means is i'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up and i hope you guys enjoyed it we got some dang good loot today man i'm really really excited about our uh, our future here next thing i really need to make is i need to make not that the uh radiation ready stuff hazmat fibers i gotta have 18 for that 18 for that 18 for that 18 for that so 18 times let me see that's 36 64 72 80 so i need 82 pieces of hazmat fiber and i'm pretty sure i'm not anywhere remotely close to that i'd go look but you know opening chests make sounds so anyway Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor, leave a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you're not already so you don't miss out on future videos. Uh, thank you guys so much for all your time. You have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later.